Use state, the most useful and most commonly used hook in all of React. React in itself is not reactive, at least in a state that if you create a variable and change its value later on, it will not be reflected in the UI. Which is why it is the most useful hook and the first on our list. Use state is a function that takes in an argument as its initial value, and it returns an array with two items. The first is a constant that contains the value of the state, typically called state, and the second is a function that could change the state by taking in a new value as its argument, typically called set state. Now the reason why it is destructured as an array is so that we can name the state and set state to whatever we want. In this example, I'm going to create a counter, so it's more reasonable to call it count and set count. Now simply place your state wherever you wish to place it in the UI, as long as it's in curly brackets, it will be fine. And I'll just place my count inside of the h1 tag. And now inside of my button, I'm going to create an onclick event and pass through to it an arrow function. And inside of the arrow function, I'll call set count and pass through to it as argument the state which is count plus one to increment the value of the state. And just like that, I now have a reactive UI and stay tuned for the follow-up videos that will cover the rest of the built-in hooks in React.